Tokenization is actually a great solution for any size organization. Whether you're small, whether you're large, tokenization can either help reduce risk or compliance. If you're a small organization, it can definitely help with the compliance burden, which is ultimately probably the biggest pain point for smaller organizations because of the cost of PCI compliance. Uh, whenever you're talking to larger organizations, compliance, uh, you know, it's just kind of an expectation because their environment's so big. Now it becomes a risk question because they're storing so much sensitive data. The average cost of uh, a card breached, according to the Panama Institute, is about $133 per card. So you can imagine millions of cards breached, you're going to end up paying a whole bunch of money. And the way that you can reduce cost, uh, actual cost to your organization using tokenization, is in scope reduction with PCI compliance. The bigger your scope, the more that needs to be assessed, the more cost, because you have the assessor on site, all the ancillary costs associated with testing, like penetration testing, application testing, things along those lines add up. So if you can use tokenization to get those different types of assets out of scope for compliance, that reduces your cost overall. The other advantage of using TokenX uh, in, in a processing environment is that you, we, we actually support multiple payment channels. Gateways and processors don't particularly do that. You know, we're able to get into the storefront, we're able to get into your e-commerce environment, we're able to offer up web services. These are things that processors aren't in the game of doing. They're in the game of providing processing capabilities, but as far as payment channel support and how you want to move your business, TokenX can enable you to move into different payment channel environments. Uh, so you guys can move forward and actually, uh, actually grow, which is ultimately what we all want to do.